We're also following late breaking developments in the search for missing UVA student Hannah Graham. The young woman disappeared two weekends ago and police have intensified their search to find a person of interest who fled from officers over the weekend. Northern Virginia Bureau Chief Jeff Goldberg has been following this story since it broke. Jeff is live in Charlottesville with these new clues that police released today. Jeff? Well, Maureen, Charlottesville police carrying out a second search warrant at the apartment of Jesse Matthew today. They did find specific items, although they won't say exactly what. Matthew has not been called a suspect in this case, but as the last known person to see Hannah Graham, police say they need to speak with him. Police have now made Jesse Matthew the target of a massive regional manhunt, while the search for Hannah Graham continues in Charlottesville and the surrounding areas. It's a sad thing. It's a sad day. I can't even begin to imagine. I'm a parent myself. I have much younger children, but it's gut-wrenching. This afternoon, investigators searching Matthew's Charlottesville apartment, leaving with several bags of evidence. Landlord Francis Lee Vandell describes Matthew as generally kind and pleasant, but not always. Well, he got pretty demanding, and he would call at night kind of late. That was not too friendly with me. Police believe that Matthew, 32 years old and a patient technician at UVA Medical Center, was with Hannah Graham on the downtown walking mall early on the morning of Saturday, September 13th. Police say this past Saturday, Matthew came to the department, asked to speak with a lawyer, and then abruptly drove off at a high rate of speed. Authorities gave chase but suspended it in the interest of public safety. Different family members have been spoken to, and I won't go into who has been cooperative or not, but needless to say, he is not here. Police say they did not arrest Matthews on Saturday because they didn't have enough evidence connecting him to Graham's disappearance. Now he is wanted on reckless driving charges, and police believe he could be just about anywhere, including where he has known associates, Maryland, New York, Pennsylvania, Virginia, and D.C. He was the last person we can show with the Hannah Graham, so he has got to have information that we need. And here now is the vehicle, vehicle description for Jesse Matthew. Police say it's his sister's 1997 light blue Nissan Sentra with Virginia tags VAC4575. And efforts in this search are expanding as the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children has requested that pictures of Hannah Graham be posted on billboards throughout Virginia. Live in Charlottesville, Jeff Goldberg, ABC7 News. Thank you, Jeff.